Hey everybody, I am Passmore Nope, and welcome back to Sly Cooper and the Thievius Raccoonus. Last time we made it into the Panda King's hideout. We passed this little intro level. Now we're here and we're getting ready to play a mini game called The King of the Hill. Cannot remember what this one is. And I think we have one more Murray racing level, but I don't think this Murray's is it. Okay, it's a Murray uh, first person shooter, and oh, that is sick. Look at his belly flapping back and forth. Dear Lord. And the square button to fire. Right on. I'll keep him covered. <laughs> if you're jiggling from waving, yeah, you I'm should probably drop a few. Fly. Not that I should judge. I got a little belly on me, but nothing like that. My God. All right. So once again, it's uh, you know, being able to kind of predict where enemies are gonna come is it's probably helpful. Uh, and since I played this one before, and I just know the overall mechanics of this. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, there we go. You got a little bit of time. They'll, they'll kind of delay their attack. Come on, there we go. Before they actually hit him. I feel like I hear one of them. Okay. Okay, uh, there we go. <laughs> That's a funny platform. Alright. Okay, so the reticle turns yellow, I've noticed, when we're on an enemy. I, don't, I didn't even notice it the first time around. Red if you're on Murray, so definitely don't shoot Murray. He has one extra hit, but you don't want to squander that by taking it off yourself. Alright. Here we go. Halfway, crap. Oh, that's right. You get to this part, and of course the end is going to be the trickiest. Oh, oh, what did we shoot there? Okay. I think that was good. Not sure. Uh, where is he? There he is. Okay, how is this going to happen? Where? Oh, 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 god. <laughs> oh boy. Got one easy, there we go. Oh, man. Definitely wanna... Oh, okay. <laughs> that made me nervous when it zoomed in. Okay, now he's up here, but now he's... I just know he's gonna get freaking ambushed. Alright, what do we got? Alright, the camera will kind of zoom in for us if we go to aim at him, I think. Okay. What sounds are you making, Murray? Good lord. Okay, these guys don't look like range attackers, but I, I'm not about to wait and find out. There we go. Gonna have to lead your shots a little bit, especially if they're up on the roof. Seems like they give us plenty of time. There we go. Okay. Woo. Man, I was gonna keep my voice hushed there. All right, we got two out of the three required keys to move on, but we're gonna go ahead and do all the levels available to us at first. Yes, yes. Thank you, Murray. Now get out of here. So I believe we will have one more uh, Murray mini game in which it's, it's you know another racing one, which it's kind of fun. I like I like taking the little breaks from. The regular gameplay. Okay, there we go. <laughs> the unseen foe. That could be uh, their name for us with our new ability. But let's see here. Um, yeah, I think that does mean we're gonna have to use our ability because uh, I don't remember any enemies having invisibility powers. So let's see. This looks like a good place to try out your new invisibility. Yeah. Move. Okay. Hold down the circle button to drop out of sight. With our tiptoeing. There we go. Yeah, we can make a little forward progress as we're sneaking around. Yeah. Remember, like I said last time, you know, if a guard spots you, you're not going to turn invisible. I just want to take a quick peek back here because I realize that we got bottles to collect. Okay, doesn't look like I missed anything obvious. So here we go. These are a little fast forward. Get up here. So, you know, this isn't, you know, it's not gonna, it's not a game changer, but it's nice to get a little forward motion uh, while we're waiting for the light to pass by. Let's see, make sure we got everything. Looks like we got some fireworks going off here. There we go, see? Make a little forward progress, and now we can move on. Oh man, okay, this looks crazy. Should be good. I believe if we go invisible, uh, those. All these laser beams and lights will pass through us, I believe. 
I mean, I'm pretty sure that's the point of all this. Yeah. Okay. So let's get out of the light there. And here these come. All right. Nothing too hard. All right. And here's a siren. Good enough. All done. All right. Not too tricky, but I have a feeling they're going to start throwing some curveballs at us, so. All right. Here's another one of these, uh, you know, cautious jumping parts. Don't want to be too anxious to get by. Oh, here's the part we have to sneak by. Let's see. Can we drop in on this guy? Yeah, looks like we can. Good enough for me. Collect a few more bottles. Only 30 in this stage, which is good because we're not collecting them at a very high rate here. Uh, let's go ahead and wait for this to go again. So I didn't have my bearings straight. Whoa, and almost jumped too soon. But we are good. All right. Uh, let's see. That looks like forward progression there. And that uh, looks like the only way to go. Can we go down? Can I get back up here if I go down? Oh, no. Okay. That's uh, the previous area. Okay. Look what we got in here. Yeah, let's move on. Whoop. Oh, ooh, that's gonna be a bastard. Maybe do some jumps here. There we go. Okay, let's get close enough to just rush in and get it. Once again, don't know if he's a ranged attacker. I would guess so. Well, maybe not, because last time, uh, in the intro level, they didn't seem to have a ranged attack. They were kind of going in for the melee hit with me. So not sure, but anyway, if you get close enough, you can take them out before they have a chance to shoot at you. And this looks like a point of no return. I believe this is the level um, that, that I had so much trouble with uh, my first playthrough. Just could not find all the collectibles. So want to make sure those little side areas are kind of tricky there. Um, but I think we have everything. Let's just move on. Let's see. There's the key right there. I'm gonna guess we cannot break through there. <laughs> no, that'll. Oh, oh no, he doesn't have a light. Okay, I got confused with what enemies I was fighting. What are these guys? What are you? Okay. Oh boy. Another one of these guys. They'll, yeah, they'll do the flip, and that doesn't hurt. And then they'll kind of delay and then attack you. So they're pretty easy to take out. Just don't let them get their attack off. Just pretty sure it's kind of wide sweeping and uh, hard to dodge and whatever might as well collect I'm gonna go look back at my old videos I'm pretty sure the I don't remember the other coins having this design I don't know maybe I'm, I'm way off pace oh okay oh, let's see uh, let's see if we can go up and get the drop on this guy Looks like the thing to do, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Good enough. Okay, so we still need freaking 12 bottles. I hope there is room for them up on here. But I'm getting a little nervous. There's a few more over there. How do I get over there? I'm afraid to just jump over here. But we'll, we'll have to come back, right? Because it exit keys over here. Alright, I'm gonna trust in my instincts. Exit keys over here, so we're definitely gonna have to come back. And holy crap. Uh, might be worth it to just get through this first without worrying about uh, getting the bottles. So let's get on through here. There we go. Not too bad. Don't have to split our attention between avoiding the lasers and getting the bottles. Looks like there's a good deal up here, so uh, my nerves are a little at ease that we're not going to have to come through this level because it's kind of a pain to go through. It takes quite a quite a bit. All right. Ah, my leg is itching me like crazy tonight. Ironically, I think as far as gameplay goes, uh, I'm probably doing the best I've done yet, so okay. My body isn't screwing me over that much. Okay, yeah, it looks like this is the place we were trying to get to earlier. And, oh my god, there better be three up here. I think there are, because I think we're going to have to drop back down through the uh, the tower here. But let's come around. Oh, what's up? What's up, Doc? What's up here? Oh, crap. Is that all? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I got one there. But if we drop down, are there going to be two inside? Let's see. Should be able to look without leaping. 
Like the camera will go. Is some kind of huge gunpowder production plant. Judging by the scale, oh, oh, no, the no. King must be making tons of explosives. Okay. I need to screw that up. And crap, looks like I have squandered all my chances of not having to redo the level. Good job, man. Did this drop? No, that'll kill me. Okay, and we took away two of my hits. Overall, not a bad video. <laughs> uh, looks like I'll be redoing this, though, and looking for the two that I'm missing. Uh, I bet if I just backtrack just a bit, they'd be there. All right, guys, I'll be right back. I'll show you where the two are, and then we'll go get what's inside the vault. Hey, everybody, I'm past more no... Uh, what am I doing? <laughs> I got confused. Hey, everybody, welcome back. Uh, all right, remember this part? Yeah, I totally forgot to go up the other tree here. Uh, I made a mental note to, but uh, I got too concerned with my forward progress I was making over here. And so with this, we can now exit the level, but we're going to climb to the top and get what is in the vault. So let's fast forward, make our way nice and quick here. Do a little speed run trick there. Go ahead over here. There we go. Remember, we want to climb all the way up. Let's see if we can do this while being fast forward. Oh, that's okay. We made it. Fair enough. Come on. All right. Now let's swing back over and make our way to the top. Screw the ninja there. Whoa, what are you going to do? Huh? Huh? All right. Here we go. Up here. And get in. Get it. Okay, went the wrong way like I always do. Six, six, and seven. Let's see what we got. Incredible! I never would have thought this was possible. Sir Augustine of Cooper's technique to briefly defy gravity. From now on, you should be able to pop right out of those bottomless pits you keep falling into, and you won't even lose a lucky charm. Okay, uh, just like our water protection, this is another great way to avoid environmental hazards. And with that, that'll do it for this level. So yeah, let's go ahead and quit it. Hit it and quit it. That's how I do it. All right, uh, with that, do we have one more level here? Let's see. Yep, looks like this will be it. So, Probably could have gotten him, but let's get out of his light. There we go. Uh, those guys are ranged attackers, turns out. Oh, man. It's another full level. Thought we'd have a minigame. Uh, we'll get uh, we'll get started on here. Um, or you know what? We're going to call this a part. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.